Now, Olivia, one of my favorite foods to eat after the beach, hands down, has to be ice cream. Ugh, I don't even need after the beach as an excuse. Ice cream all the time. Well, unfortunately, we're working, so we can't go do that. But Tiffany gets to go see a place right now and eat as much as she wants. I'm kind of jealous, actually. We're here at Brewster's Ice Cream to get a taste of some old-fashioned ice cream. They call themselves a scoop above the rest, and for good reason. They have a home-style mix fresh from the dairy and delivered to each store, so their customer gets to try a premium flavor just like the good old days. Hello? <gasps> you must be Tiffany? Yes. I heard you guys offer free samples, so I just couldn't help but start sampling myself. Well, I'm glad that you did. We have so many flavors. We make our ice cream in-house every day, and we have about 30 ice creams, and plus we have ices and sherbets as well. I believe that was a Graham Central Station, and that might be the best thing I've had in my life. It is amazing. It's definitely one of our best sellers. It's Graham ice cream with swirls of Graham crust and flakes of chocolate. Are these all special and unique to Brewster's? Well, definitely the Graham Central Station is. Plus, we have others like um, Death by Chocolate. What is in a Death by Chocolate? Oh, my gosh. I am it intrigued is. by the name. Well, it's Hershey's Dark Chocolate Ice Cream with swirls of fudge, chunks of chocolate, chunks of brownies, and chocolate-covered Krispies. So, Leslie, when I first came in, I was a little bit confused. I didn't know if I should have come inside, ordered outside. Oh, it's definitely a walk-up window where you order from outside, get your treats, and then um, we have outside seating where the customer can enjoy the day. Now, when I walked in, it smelled delicious. What is that smell? Those would be our freshly made waffle cones, and they are delicious. That makes the ice cream taste so much better, right? Now, I've always been so curious in how to make ice cream. Can you show me? Well, you know what? I can have my husband, Will, show you how to make ice cream since he's our certified ice cream maker. Oh, I'm hi, Tiffany. Hi. Nice to meet nice you. To meet so you. Leslie told me that you are going to teach me how to make ice cream. Yes. Got to grab that chocolate syrup. Okay. And you pour it into the machine. Look at that That's fudge. You're, you're a pro already. <laughs> this is the cream. You got to pour in that. That's heavy, so. I am a professional ice cream eater and maker now. And so then press you just that. Just turn that on. And now we'll wait for it to cool down and freeze. Once it's ready, we're going to add the flavor so that it so that it mixes into the ice cream. That's good. Okay, that's good. Perfect. Now get some peanut butter and, and, and put that in there. There you go. Nice. Spin it. I am hoping to get certified. <laughs> so I can eat as much ice cream as I can that I make. <laughs> the final test. Mm. So rich in taste and the flavor and so fresh. Thank you so much, Will. I am officially a fan of Brewster's. And you know what? I'm just going to take this bucket. All right. <laughs>